Wait, there was no dialogue, but they won't feel the lack. Controversy. So a lot of people are, you know, giving their two cents. And I saw like the discourse when it came out there, which is perfectly fine. Hey, he's an auteur and he's a great filmmaker. And I disagree. So obviously with Dune part two coming out this week and a lot of people are just raving about it and everything. And then of course you got Mr. Villeneuve talking to the press and we have Variety right here that is uh, talking about one of the quotes that he had today that was a little bit of a discourse that happened online when it came to what he had to say right here when it comes to filmmaking and how he approaches it and what he remembers when he goes to see a film. Denai Villeneuve says movies have been corrupted by television. Frankly, I hate dialogue. Dialogue is for theater and television. I don't remember movies because of a good line. I remember movies because of a strong image. I'm not interested in dialogue at all. Pure image and sound. That is the power of cinema, and it is something not obvious when you watch movies today. Movies have been corrupted by television. In a perfect world, I make a compelling movie that doesn't feel like an experiment, but does not have a single word in it either. People would leave the cinema and say, wait, there was no dialogue, but they won't feel the lack. Controversy. So a lot of people are, you know, we're like, you know, giving their two cents. And I saw like the discourse when it came out there, which is perfectly fine. Hey, he's an auteur and he's a great filmmaker. And I disagree with him right here, but I understand where he's coming from because he is that vision. I watched Dune last night and yes, he is a visual director. He tells his story mainly by visuals and sound. And when it comes to dialogue, you don't really remember too much when it comes to that, but you remember the visuals. And I totally understand that. But then you have somebody like Quentin Tarantino, dialogue. He's looking at it like that. And I'm just kind of going like, well, you don't, you don't remember a movie from a, 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 a piece of dialogue, a line. I'm like, yeah, there's some of the most memorable movies have lines that you say over and over again to people. You know, how many times your favorite movie, you just say the lines, you say to your friends and they know exactly what movie you're talking about right there. So little, I was like, ah, I don't know about what, about that, Mr. Villeneuve. Villeneuve. Um, he also has talked about too, when it comes to, when it comes to uh, Dune 3. Now Dune 3, he actually also had something to say about Dune 3, where he said he didn't want to rush. He didn't want to rush into Dune 3 because he feels like Hollywood and everything rushes. Yeah, a lot of like, you know, things that people were like, you know, there's a little bit of a discourse with some of his quotes that he has say, but he said he didn't want to rush into Dune 3. This is, I just hope there is a Dune 3. And I think, you know, if the, bo you know, the box office opening weekend sounding like it's going to be good, he didn't want to rush into Dune 3 because he feels like, you know, too many times they rush into a sequel. You know, obviously he's already got his next movie plan that's based on some book. That sounds pretty awesome. 